welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, I'm Kaz and welcome to my video. Today is a very exciting day. It's the first time I've ever done new makeup releases that I am eyeing to buy. And that is what's coming up next. If you want to see what I am eyeing to buy in the new, well, I suppose January, um, carry on watching. Right, I'm, that's why I'm in this position. We're going to cover up the skull boy here with the pictures. Hopefully, if my new equipment works. So, I have my phone. The first things first is this. It's the Sabrina palette. Wow. Sarah tagged me in it and goes, cast, 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 look. And then we saw the inside today. It is the um, 19th. 19th of January at the moment um, and the colours look fantastic. There is a pop of yellow, pop of orange, black, most important in the palette for me. Um, it just looks great. Um, the lipsticks, yeah, I have new lipstick on today. This is Manny's uh, from Luna Beauty. I have tested this out today along with this eye look which is uh, coming up soon. Yes, it's coming up soon from Juvia's Place, The Greens. Me likes The Greens. Anyway, uh, this Sabrina palette I am eyeing. Now, on Trend Mood, which is where I get most of my um, things from on the, on the Facebook trend, trend Mood, it says it is $35. Um, technically, converted by my Alexa, that is £26.90. I'm not sure what it will be, but I do believe it is coming out 21st of January. Toby's birthday. He can buy me it for his birthday. <laughs> I don't think it works that way. But anyway, um, the next thing is this. Um, now, I've never wanted to be and not never wanted. I have never been inspired by Kylie. Um, and you have to pay shipping and everything else. So it is, um, it doesn't say how much it is, but it'll be in dollars. <laughs> and it'll be from over there and I'd have to pay shipping, etc. But it's just the purples. I was looking at that uh, middle shade. Um, I, I just like them. Um, and for some reason, I've just got into purples. And I, I'm sure Sarah would like this as well. But um, the swatches just look so perfect. Are they? I don't know. Has anyone else tried Kylie? I don't know. But I was eyeing it. The next one is this, which is the Hourglass. The Hourglass Concealer. Now, it is a stick. The Hourglass Foundation for me, because I talk and smile a lot, started cracking here. Um, not cracking, but grooves there. So whether this concealer would be too grease, too group, blah, 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 too um, sticky to go under my eyes, because that's why I like a nice serum-y one. But I was looking at it and it comes in a humongous amount of shades, doesn't it? So I was thinking that I might, I might. Uh, £16.91 was the conversion of $22. I don't know. It's probably going to be £22. But I thought I'd do a conversion. Um, the next one is Lime Crime. Now, I have never, ever tried Lime Crime. And I'm looking, obviously, at the cooler um, one and i was thinking i wonder if they're all shimmers because i don't know looking at this and um and um, and um, and um, uh, bring it in um, uh, zooming it in there we go there's only the black the white and the purple that looks shimmery i'm not interested in any of the others the the blue lipstick looks quite nice but i have jeffree stars so um yeah i don't know we don't know how much it is either lime crime is on beauty bay i think Yes, I think it is. So it is something I could get in. But anyway, the move, move, movie, the movie purple nude, light nude, peacock blue, um, are the three. There you go, the three. I don't know. I don't know. I, I just 
spied it and thought, ooh. The next thing, now I've never wanted to buy from Fenty. Uh, I don't like the idea of her having mink lashes. Yeah. But when this come up, the new mascara that apparently extends your lashes to the extreme. Ooh. Um, and the colours, the colours of these fly pencils. Fly. Don't know why they call it fly. Fly. Fly pencil. Does it because it flies? Probably glide. I don't know. But anyway, fly pencil. I uh, hope it's not made with flies. <laughs> Um, the colours in there are beautiful, and the reason I'm looking at that is because I liked the cap. I like the Cap Von D one because it's thick like that, and they look thick. And this one is easy to get on your eyes. I use it today. You just gets it on. I can like stick it, whoop, whoop, and it it gels in and it sticks there better than a pencil one. So I was looking at these and thinking, are these because it says pencil eyeliner. Yet they're rounded, which would be easier to get. I don't know. I was just eyeing them and thought, oh, look at all those pretty blues. The black. The pretty blues. <laughs> but I do quite like that. Um, £18.49. Uh, £18.45, £24. You see, I don't know. I don't know. The next one is this. Violet Voss. Now, I did have quite a few palettes from Violet Voss and I really did like them. But there was only like the bottom, most of her palettes are the bottom corner, if you notice well. The bottom corner is the bit that attracts you, the rest of brown nudes uh, of different shades of the same colour. Um, obviously, yeah. Uh, you know what I mean. Variation of the same colour. And I was not interested. But this, oh my gosh, that purple palette hello again don't know what's wrong with me i like my purples but it really did intrigue me it's so bluey as and pinky as well it just intrigued me and the swatches and violet ross is very very good with their formula now it works out about 13.84 for that small palette eight it says fun size mini eyeshadow palette in sweet violet uh, 10 matte shades, creamy foils, magical metallics and satin sheens. 13 84 it works out at. It's probably going to be 18 quid. They're usually the same. But anyway, I don't know. It'll be on um, the little beauty bay as well. So there's no taxes and costs of shipping. Oh, yeah. Now the next one. It was, ooh, ugh. <laughs> I looked at this, the Latte two from um oh gone dominique cosmetics um i looked at that and i thought ah oh. but it reminded me of the latte one and it also reminded me of her new moon one and a few others it reminded me like oh i haven't tried that brand yet ha so no no to this one but yes to some of her older ones, it reminded me of, oh, I haven't tried them that brand, brand yet, and it's meant to be really, really good. So there we go. It wasn't this one, it's the others. <laughs> Bit of a cheat, but hey. Um, £32, $42. I'm not sure how much there will be, but they are in Beauty Bay. Now, this popped up, Colourpop! Um, they're meant to be, and I thought, oh yeah! That one's all right. I do have lots of minty green shades. I have lots and lots of minty green shades. But um, it reminded me to go on Colourpop. This one was out of stock. So I bought the green and the blue palette. Um, uh, I can't remember off the top of my head what they were called. No. But you know the, the similar one to this, which is green and the blue one the other green one and the blue one and i can't remember i can't remember what it look look palette i can't remember what it is but you know what it is those i was looking at if i find a picture i'll stick it here <laughs> oh dear but yes and i thought ooh, it's quite nice even the mint one's quite nice but some of the reviews are saying that it's not so there we go uh 12 dollars. it's going to be 12 dollars, and you do pay taxes and shipping on the site so therefore, when you order from Colourpop, <clears throat> excuse me, when you order from Colourpop, you actually get the shipping and the taxes all worked out um, and you pay it. So there's no surprise as the way with the Jeffree Star. 
Um, the next one is this one, Elf. Now, I've never tried Elf, ever. And I'm sure they're cruelty free. But I just thought these are $3 each, which would be a couple of quid or £2.50 or even three quid. They're still worth the price. And look at those two. The top one, the green one, the blue one, purpley one, sorry. And maybe one of the others to try. Um, I'm, I am looking at this bottom one as well. Um, e, the one with the silver, not the one with the blue. But I just thought for three pound, three dollars, not bad. Some drugstore ones for a change. Um, so yeah, yeah, I think I might. Um, the next thing was it cosmetics. Now, as you know, recently I have finished up a long last after two years probably of having it i've used the it cosmetics cream this is spf 50 as well it's a broad spectrum which means it, it you can use it on your oils and everywhere else um and it comes in lots of shades now i wasn't thinking of getting the actual uh liquidy squeezy tube one the bye bye powder um is a foundation powder and i thought oh because i am into that i've got foundation on today the uh w7 buff on today and i do like it it's covered up all my um imperfections but the powder is something i go for in a daytime because i cannot you know quick do your sink skincare dive them off to school come back bang some powder uh, blah, blah, primer on and powder boom, boom 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 done um so i was eyeing that now, the cost of that, oh, these are all the shades here, which I thought was a good shade selection this time at Cosmetics, better than five. Um, could have one deeper maybe, but better than five. And um, it says here $54 for the whole set. That includes the brush and everything. So I don't know. But QVC does it Cosmetics and you can go on it Cosmetics in, in the UK as well. So hmm, I in that one. Um, now, this one, I wasn't going to say I was eyeing the Kat Von D blushes, blushes. But what I was going to say is I am eyeing and watching their new products of KVD Vegan Beauty. They have gone completely vegan as well as cruelty free, obviously, but completely, completely vegan. Um, and as you know, the, it, she's been uh, bought out of her company so that's why it's not cat von d's kvd vegan beauty um but these shades do look absolutely lovely especially that rosebud shade that would be nice i haven't got any on today at all and you can tell i'm pale um but the packaging so i can't wait to see is she going to keep putting her flair into the packaging probably not because she's been bought out but uh am i in the brand that's why that's here um twenty dollars for those blushes and that's it that is it i can come back in the middle mm -hmm. there we go well there we go um tell me your views in the below what we, what are you eyeing what are you spying what are you wanting to buy it all means the same <laughs> um and if you like this kind of video i know i could do new makeup releases every week um but i find everyone goes to everybody else and to put my video on the playlist i don't know how to do that <laughs> i honestly don't sarah help um but i do enjoy telling you what i am eyeing to buy and i do in videos waffle and i go oh yeah and i'm really looking forward to this one and this one and this one um so i thought i'd collate them all into one video if you like it please hit the likes button so i know you really did or comment that'd be great and i shall see you in my next video thank you for watching and i'll ta-ta for now